Hi guys, this is Tracy from Northeast Tarot and welcome to your bonus read. This is a collective read for all of the zodiac signs for the Leo full moon that is taking place on February 16th, 2022. Let's see what the energies are coming up here for the collective. Let's see. For the Leo full moon. What is the collective energies? Okay, we are starting out with the Page of Cups. We have, let's see, the Seven of Cups. What is going on with the collective for the Leo Full Moon? Okay, we have the wheel. And these are all landing upright, guys. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Welcome to all of you. Thank you so much for joining me here today. If you're not subscribed, please do subscribe. Also, if you could please give this video a thumbs up, I would greatly appreciate that. I'm going for one more. This is for the collective, for the Leo full moon. Wow, we have the moon. So, psychic vibes uh, right away. But there's good news. And so, there could have been some illusion, confusion, delusion around a particular mat matter for some of you. Maybe you were thinking the worst. But there's, there's positive news. So this is looking at uh, the collective energies for the next couple of weeks. And change is coming in. I feel like there's positive news coming in. And, you know, it may be a pleasant surprise for some of you um, because I feel like there was some illusion, delusion, confusion around something. Also, a lot of fear for some of you around a particular matter. Look at this. I didn't even see this. At the bottom of the deck, guys, we have the star. So you have the, the moon and the star showing up here. This is pretty amazing along with the wheel of fortune pretty amazing and so yeah i'm seeing wish fulfillment definitely and i'm seeing news and so even if you're not um fully manifesting something at this time you are on the right path uh, you are actually manifesting for some of you a wish, a dream come true. And I feel like there's going to be some sort of communication that comes in at this time that's very positive. And it may put your mind at ease because some of you, you definitely were maybe overthinking a situation. Maybe you didn't have enough information. There was just a lot of fear, a lot of fear around a particular matter, maybe even some of you fearing change, needing more information. But again, I see news coming in here at this time, and it's very positive. For some of you, this can be... Um, a, a time of healing for some of you emotional and spiritual healing taking place but also I mean once you hear this uh, I feel like there's peace of mind that's coming in for some of you you could be mending a relationship there could be an apology that's coming in the first card out is the Page of Cups. And so there definitely could be an apology coming in for some of you. Or you could be reaching out. 
you got to take it how it resonates you could be the the one that's reaching out you could be communicating with somebody maybe you needed more information you could be taking a chance here trusting your intuition even though there's a lot of fear we see you moving in the right direction a lot of spiritual energy here around you at this time this is you being divinely guided and protected For many of you, your intuition is, is definitely turned up a notch here at this time. You could be having some very vivid dreams. And you could be working with a particular person. You have the two of coins here. Some of you possibly juggling. Now that does not always mean relationships. Although I definitely could be reading for some of you that are single and you definitely have multiple choices in love at this time. Yeah, I feel like you are definitely calming your mind. Some of you were very much in your head. Fears may be going round and round. A lot of worry, a lot of doubt prior but during this time i feel like balance is being restored there could be some new options some new choices that are opening up for you here at this time and it's because they're meant to with the wheel and the star again a lot of spiritual energy divine protection um, but yeah, some things are meant for you and, and what's unfolding here at this time, guys, is, is something that's meant for you. And maybe there was a lot of worry around this, but there's good news. And for some of you, there's maybe doors that are opening up at this time. There's new choices. There's new options wow that are coming in for you look at this we have this beautiful ace of coins this big beautiful ace and so this this definitely is a work opportunity for many of you and some of you don't see this coming with the moon here her eyes are closed there's a lot of fog there's a lot of confusion um, for others, this is something that perhaps was maybe hidden. And so again, doors are opening here. Now, for some of you, not all of you, but for some of you, there could be a business partnership. Someone could be coming in and helping you, but that's, that's not all of you. But for some of you, somebody could be helping you. That could be an Aquarius, that could be, for some of you, a Scorpio, possibly a Leo, a Taurus, or Pisces. Uh, but, and again, I apologize for any noise in the background, but this is meant for you um, at this time oh my god look at this this is beautiful we have the page of coins here so for some of you this could be an opportunity to maybe go back to school for some of you um it could be a new job um and you're receiving this this news here at this time but for some of you this this may have something um to do with schooling so if you are landing a new job maybe it's going to be required that you take some online classes or something like that here you may have to make a decision here at this time in regards to this but this is very positive the star represents faith you having faith you having hope and i feel uh -huh. like with the seven of cups and the moon here there's been confusion and there still could be some some confusion and some doubt and some worry here but you are definitely calming your mind definitely it's not going to be as bad here in the next couple of weeks 
you are restoring balance here, especially when it comes to your thoughts. And if you were having, um, for some of you, if you were having a problem with, let's say, like time management, getting, you know, certain things done, I see you being able to manage things a little bit better here at this time. Could be that some of you work at night. That's not all of you, but some of you may actually work at night or there's an opportunity coming in for you to work at night. Um, we see you taking a chance here. I see that you have several choices in front of you, but maybe maybe one in particular um, looks better than all the rest. So uh, at this there time, there definitely could be someone coming in. Now, maybe some of you are doing some online dating, but I think that you're going to actually really get lucky here. So if you are doing some online dating... Yeah, I feel like some of you are getting lucky. So, I mean, it could be that you're meeting. This could be someone very spiritual for some of you. Uh, it could be any one of the signs that I already mentioned. Uh, Aquarius coming through very strong here. We also have very strong water here. So it could be Pisces, Cancer, possibly Scorpio. Um, but yeah, um... You may have a variety of choices, and so you could be, you know, having some fun here, um, browsing, but I feel like one of these choices is really good, is really good, and so stay positive. All right, additional guidance for the collective, please, for the Leo full moon. What is the additional guidance for the collective, please? Yeah, look at this. New moon in Cancer. Relax. And then we have full moon in Cancer. Let your fears dissolve. Look at that. So Cancer is coming through very strong. So there definitely may be a Cancer connection. But we have full moon vibes and we have new moon vibes. So, yeah, change is coming in. For some of you, this is something you were hoping for, wishing for. It's very positive. There's good news coming in. Let your fears dissolve. And so, yeah, I mean, it couldn't resonate more. Let's see what's at the bottom. First quarter moon in Erie. Step into your power which you know for some of you once your fears do dissolve you will you will step into your power this aries energy all right let's see additional guidance for the collective please for the leo full moon some of you will be taking some sort of chance here Just stay positive. Be patient. Not all is known. Let's see. So we have increase, number three. We also have teacher, number four. And then we have deserving. This is number six. So very nice. Um, I could be reading for some teachers. Those of you that are landing a new job, it could be some sort of teaching position for some of you. But look at this. We have an increase, which is great. And we have teacher. So there's something that you're learning. For some of you, this was maybe something that was hidden yeah, maybe you are not seeing something clearly, but clarity is coming in. There's something you're learning, and you deserve this. You deserve this. And so you need to tell yourself that. Maybe there was um, some doubt, some self-doubt around this. 
you not maybe feeling worthy because this is big this is big for some of you this is big success it's beautiful i'm just seeing you know what other decks i feel drawn to use all right let's pull you an angel answers oracle for the collective please this is for the leo full moon this is for the collective what else does the collective need to know please so we do have weight because not all is known Look at this, we have forgiveness. Hmm. Very interesting. So take what resonates and leave the rest. Uh, maybe some of you were worried that maybe someone wasn't going to forgive you or something like that. Some of you could be waiting on forgiveness or, you know, vice versa, take it how it resonates. You may need to communicate, but not all is known. So be patient. You will know when it's the right time. You definitely will know when it's the right time. Yeah, look at this. <laughs> look at this at the bottom. Within the next few weeks, we have forgiveness. Within the next few weeks, look at this, abundance. This is beautiful. And then we have, there's something better. So, yeah. So be patient. Have faith. This is beautiful. Let's see what signs you're dealing with. Could be any of the signs already mentioned but we do have strong cancer coming through aquarius cancer possibly pisces scorpio who is the collective dealing with we also have aries coming through Virgo coming through and Sagittarius. Okay. Very nice. So guys, I hope that you found this collective read helpful. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and make sure that you are subscribed. All right, guys. Full moon